Do you believe when you ask that you can fix their thing, their problem, give them that solution, help them with that need, yes or no? If it's a yes, you hard ask. All certainty, all conviction, all belief, all state, all that they need to say yes. All right, guys, Andy Elliott. If you're new to this channel, this is a sales channel, entrepreneur channel, entrepreneur channel, CEO channel, business channel. I don't care what it is. If you want to scale, if you want to grow, I've been known as a sales guy. We got the largest sales training company in the world. We're training over 500,000 salespeople and 10,000 companies. In this video, I was going to give you one technique that'll help you sell more, help you sell any product, and be the greatest at what you do. But then I was thinking, why don't I give you two tactics, okay? So I lied to you on the title, I'm actually gonna give you two, okay? But I need you to do me a favor. When we train, we gotta write something down, okay? What's written will be retained. Your brain, this is how it works. I'm gonna tell you something right now, it's gonna change your life, but your brain's gonna delete it in about 10 minutes from now, okay? So I want you to do me a favor, I just want you to jot it down on a napkin, a piece of paper, I want you to write it down. What's written will be retained, and if you write this down, I'm gonna give you two tactics, two strategies that I'm positive that'll help you sell more. By the way, as I go over both of these, you're gonna be like, I knew that's where I was missing it. Or you're gonna be like, dude, I know, that's why people can't ever sell me, because they do that or they don't do that right. Does that make sense? Okay, so I love you guys. This video was made for you so you can sell more, so you can convert more, and so you can be the best. Let's get to number one. All right, guys, so here we go. Step one, write this down. You gotta know when to make the ask. See, a lot of people, they ask at the wrong time. I want you to write this down. If you've done your job giving enough value, giving enough reciprocity, making the customer feel a certain way the whole time. Remember, people always remember what you said, but they'll always remember the way you made them feel. You should know that you're so good at what you do that you've, you've given enough value. Listen, I wanna explain this to you, ready? Give, 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 ask. That's what we were taught. How about I give you something else, are you ready? When do you know when to make the ask? Here, give, give, give. Give, 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 ask. Sell every time. And I'm gonna tell you why people do this wrong because they think sales is something you blurt out. Oh yeah, our product does this, blah, 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 blah. Ask, nope. And you're like, oh wait, well, hold on, I got an objection. No, dude, you didn't get an objection, you asked at the wrong time and you didn't give enough value. There's this old saying, write this down, when value exceeds price, the price isn't too high. When value exceeds price, people don't, you don't have to ask people to buy, people say, when can we get start started? What do we need to do next to get this thing? How quick can we get that delivered to us? How does this work? Listen, a lot of the times whenever I'm selling anyone on anything, I never have to physically ask them. They stop me and they go, when can we take delivery of this? Or how soon can we get that product started? Can you tell us how this works? We're completely in on it. What do we need to do next? They're actually asking you because you've over delivered. Write this down. We are in an era where no one over delivers anymore. There's this thing called reciprocity where when you do something for someone, it makes someone want to do something back for you. By the way, I want to explain this to you. When I said give, 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 and I went through that deal, what was I doing? Giving, giving, and giving, and I'm, I'm making people internally, people have an operating system inside of them, that when I've given so much, whether it was a compliment, whether it was love, whether it was the way that I made them feel, or whether it was attention, or whether it was value, it was all these things stacked together. At some point, something clicks inside, and they say, I need to give something back, okay? You guys got it? And, and, and this is why the art of selling has died. Guys, I'm obsessed with the art of selling. I've, I've built, I did 160 million last year. We're gonna do 250 million this year. I need you to understand something, okay? I have, my business hadn't been in business for 25 years. I've been in business for five years. I've been in sales for 25 years of my life. I've done it wrong. I've seen everybody do it wrong. I see people still doing it wrong today. Since COVID, people had to wear a mask, stand six feet apart, okay? People were made for communion and to be close like this, but then everybody got a long ways away. Now, everywhere you go, every restaurant you go to, people turn around the thing. They say, do you wanna leave a 20% tip? You bought a cup of coffee. They didn't even serve you. It wasn't a restaurant and yet they wanted a tip. People want things without giving. They want things without, you know, um, earning it. We're in, in this industry, in this era where over, de over delivery doesn't exist. You guys know what I mean, right? Okay. So you're alive in a very special time right now where if you were to learn the art of sales, it is an art. 
just like an artist. This is a canvas when I'm talking to a customer. I am the artist. This is my paintbrush. This is my paintbrush. This is my paintbrush. This is my canvas. This is my relationship. And I can paint this relationship to look like whatever I want. And then if I do that and I ask at the right time, they will always say yes. Okay? So step one, you got to ask at the right time. All right. The fun part now. Now that we're going to ask at the right time, I want you to do me a favor. I want you to do this. Ask hard or don't ask at all. Okay, I want you to understand something, right? If I'm picking up the phone, I'm checking in with the customer, if I'm doing anything and I'm like, man, I want to upsell this person, I want to sell this thing, or I want to sell this client. Listen, if you've asked at the right time and you've give, 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 and you've done all this, when you ask, are you wanting them to do what it is that you want them to do? Are you that certain that your product will solve their problem, fix what they need, help them not to struggle, make sure that the thing that they want done ha gets done? Can, can, you, can you make sure that all that happens? Yes, if you feel that way, ask hard and be for sure about it. Like, look, don't half ask. So write this down, don't half ass ask. What does that mean? Don't, don't either be hot or, or be cold. Either do it or don't do it. But don't be lukewarm, because people will spit you right out of their mouth, okay? So when I'm talking to someone, if I know that my product can help them, it goes like this. All right, Jesse, so based on everything that I told you, this is where you're at, this is where we're gonna go. Number one, I'm gonna take responsibility for solving your problem. There's the day you're born, the day you die, and the day your life changes forever. Today, your life changes. Total recreation happens. You're gonna lose that weight. This thing's gonna get fixed. You're no longer gonna struggle. This thing is gonna get changed. This is what your new life looks like. This is what we're going towards, and that all starts today, Jesse. So thank you so much for your business. I love you, I appreciate you. There's the day you're born, I said, the day you die, and the day your life changes forever. The only regret that you'll have is that you didn't do this three years ago when you see the results. It's going to be mind-blowing. So Jesse, I got you. I'm taking full responsibility. I'm going on this journey with you. You guys are like family to us. Let's kill it. It's like, it's a hard ask. It's like, I'm not asking you, do you want to do this? Like, we're doing this. Like, listen, do you believe when you ask that you can fix their thing, their problem, give them that solution, help them with that need? Yes or no? If it's a yes, you hard ask. All certainty, all conviction, all belief, all state, all that they need to say yes. You've already give, 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 give. Now, certainty goes through the roof and all of a sudden you come out and say, hey, I'm taking accountability for this account, for this relationship. This is not transactional. This is relational and I am gonna help you cross the finish line with this thing and make sure that this gets seen through. We're gonna help you with our product and with your problem and this is gonna get solved today and it will never exist again. I got you. It is a hard ask. Or if you feel like based on everything, you don't think that your problem could solve there, don't even ask. Don't even ask. I would rather you not ask at all than to halfway ask, which is like, well, you know, basically, Jesse, based on what you said, you know, you're kind of doing okay. I mean, you know, I mean, our, our product could help you a, a little bit better. Like it could help increase some things, you know what I'm saying? But it seems like you're doing all right on your own. But you know, I mean, our stuff would, I mean, it could help. It's like, what, what are we doing here? Like, are we in or are we out? Do we want them to do it or do we don't want them to do it? What is it? Hard ask, solve, close, or don't ask. Okay, no lukewarm. Okay, no cool. If you're gonna ask, you close, period. All your belief, all your conviction, all the give, 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 ask at the right time, hard ask it, take responsibility. This is getting solved. I'm gonna be sure of it. You would have made it the call if you didn't wanna get this thing fixed and we're fixing this thing now. I've got you, I live for my clients, I've heard you out, I've listened to everything you said, and we can 500% solve this problem. This will be the last day you ever struggle with that again. I'm going with you, let's go. It's a hard ask. And so, and so with these two tactics, guys, when you ask, and, and do it the way, go back to number one and watch it again, okay? And then if you're gonna ask, ask hard, okay? These two things will help you close way more deals. Now, by the way, I know this and I am living proof of it that this works, okay? Because I do it all the time. And by the way, this is not a pressure tactic. This is not a pressure tactic. This is a persuasive technique. Does your 
product help people solve their problems, yes or no? If the answer is yes, it would be disrespectful of you not to close them because they would continue to struggle, continue to stay the same, or even worse, end up at your competition who won't take care of them if you can. Do you understand now? Do you understand why if you're gonna ask, you ask at the right time, and then when you ask at the right time, you ask hard because you know that it's the right thing to do. Listen, I don't want you to get people to do something in right. I want you to get, if your product is the right thing for them that they need, then guess what? Then ask the right way and bring more certainty than you've ever brought in your life and ask hard. Let them look into your eyes and go, this person's more for sure of this, this thing's gonna help me than I've ever seen anything in my life, I'm in. That's the courage they need to make the decision now. They need to get it from you. So they're hard asks only, and that's when we ask at the right time behind the give, 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 give. Reciprocity, okay, is the greatest selling skill of all times. Okay, so guys, listen, every single day, I try to give value. I try to drop a little bit of content here and there um, that can, for free, that can help you guys scale and grow. If you found some value in this video and you're like, man, dude, I, I, I see that. That's definitely a, a place for me to grow and get better. This is an opportunity where you're probably obs obsessed with learning like I am, okay? I wanna tell you this, if you knew everything that I knew, you would have a $100 million business. If you, if you knew everything that I knew, and I'm on my way to a billion dollar business, you would be on your way to a billion dollar business too. Doesn't matter who you are, everybody's qualified, you just don't know what to do and you're, you don't have the right edge. That's the way it works. Down in the description box below, I put a link, okay? If you're a psycho competitor, if you're obsessed, if you wanna go on this journey of self-development, right? It's like, don't wish it was easier, wish you were better, okay? It's all about from today forward. If you're looking in the mirror and you're like, I've got way more potential, how do I get that? There's a, there's a link down in the description box below. You can click on it, it's gonna ask you for your name, your phone number, your email, and it's, you're gonna answer eight questions. If you answer these eight questions right, and I look at these eight questions and it comes to me and I say, man, this person right here aligns with the values that I believe in, this person's gonna go big in life. I wanna build the greatest leaders of all time, not only to earn a lot of money, but also impact the world and create big companies and, and, and be the best at what they do, the top one percenters. If you, if you feel like that's you, go down to the description box right now, you can fill out your information, click that, and then if I reach out to you in the next 24 hours, it means that the way that you answer the questions is what I'm looking for. We'll make a plan and let's kill it. Guys, I love you, I appreciate you, have a blessed day, God bless. I'll see you in the next video.